What's up guys? Uh, today I'm going to give you guys a little uh, review of my zero board. Um, I'm making a video because I subscribed to a local skateboarder who apparently I saw a zero board and it kind of inspired me to make one. So shout out to him. I'll post, his, uh, I'll post a link to his uh, channel so you guys can subscribe to him. So yeah, uh, this is a zero board. I recently got this in Zoomies. Um, I could have made it on my own but I was too lazy and I was in a hurry that day and I couldn't set up my board so I was very very busy so I had like 30 minutes to spare for the guy to build it for me so as you can see I'm running on mob zero grip tape for mob mob really does fuck your shoe up that's all I can say it really does fuck your shoe up I'm running on shorty's hardware so yeah by the way he kinda tightened them up I told him to tighten them up so and you can feel the grip tape. There's air bubbles already in it, but it's because I haven't put pressure on them. And this is the, the deck itself. Pretty sexy, huh? I love Zero. It's been my childhood dream to get a deck like this. Um, pretty amazing. I love the graphic, all black. I've seen the orange one, but I prefer the black and red. Really original. Uh, I'm running on Venture Trunks. Bones Wheels. 51 millimeter. Running on reds bearings. The beauty of my venture trunks is it's black here and it's red in the bottom. Matches the freaking board itself. It's got good concave. It's got very good concave. It's got a good pop. I haven't popped it. I used to own a zero board like this, but mine was the the one that I told you about the the skateboarder that I subscribed to. It was just like his, except mine snapped. Uh, it was already worn out too. So, but zero has been my most favorite board of them all. There's a side view of it. Very beautiful deck. I mean, I personally myself love it. Um, I do skate. I um, actually don't know how to do much tricks on my board right now. I just recently got back in it like several weeks ago. And the reason behind I got into it is because a couple of friends of mine are trying to like get this in a good view for you guys. Um, the reason I got back on it is because, you know, my my friends, they all skate, they all cruise. And they wanted me to go into it. They, they told me to get into it, you know, get involved into the skateboarding community, learn how to do, you know, just hang out. Here where I live at, well, not all people are dicks. Some of them are, but... Some of them don't care, so if you ride a Walmart board, they'll train you until the board snaps and then they'll give you a new one. They'll actually even buy you a new board, which is kind of pretty cool where I live at. Um, I live in Texas. But this is basically a good board. I just love it. I'll be doing another board. I have a, another skateboard. I'll be doing another review on that too. But this is a, a zero board. I freaking love zero. If you have a zero board, please put it in the description below. On the, on the com Actually, put it in the comment section. And let me know if you have a zero board. I would be gladly to like it and I'll subscribe to you definitely. Anybody that's got a zero board deserves a subscription because I mean zero, even though Chris Cole's no longer in it, zero is still good. Even if the team no longer exists, it's still a good team in my best opinion. So shout out to zero for that, but it's pretty amazing. I just love it. So hey guys, this is basically my zero board review. Uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to comment, rate, subscribe, like this video if you don't, whatever. But, like I say, guys, um, this is my setup, my main setup. I'll post a video of all four of my boards. I have two Walmart boards, and yeah, I'll explain why I have those there. But then again, guys, please go ahead and like this video and tell me what you think about it. And yeah, thumbs up for zero. Thanks for watching. Peace.